Um, I'm super excited. I mean, in the, you know, the four years I've been here, I've never been given the opportunity to play them, so it's super exciting. Um, they're a great team, and um, I think with uh, the home field advantage and the crowd we draw, it'll be really exciting and have a fun been, environment. Have you been able, I know in, the, in this rush of what you guys are doing right now, but have you been able to step back at all and look at your four years that, you know, the end is coming up and just sort of take it all in and understand what it all meant? Yeah, I mean... As I look back, it's sad to think that this could, you know, that it's coming to an end. Um, but I couldn't be more grateful for the opportunity to play here. It's been an amazing experience. Um, I've never played with such teammates that are so amazing, that have a, such a, a desire to play this game and passion, and then amazing coaches that, that taught me so much on and off the field. And I feel like, um, as a person, I've developed on and off the field, and I give that thanks to my teammates and my coaches. Can you think back to last year when you missed the NCAA tournament? That did you guys imagine that you could be in this spot right now? Um, yeah, I think last year I took as motivation to come out and beat the odds. Um, we didn't do well as well as we did in our conference last year, and then we didn't make it to the tournament. And so this year we made it a goal and a personal goal for me to make sure that you know we win conference championships and that we can make it as far as we can. And Elite Eight is an amazing way to end, and I hope you know to continue on to the Final Four. Do you think having a year like, like last year maybe galvanized you guys so that maybe you even improved your play? Yeah, definitely. I think, like I said, we took it as motivation. Um, we were all shocked by it um, because we have such great talent. Um, you know, it, we weren't going to waste another year and let um, last year affect us, and we're going to bounce back and play the best that we could. Do you ever feel any uh, – the BYU defense is the one that is what drives your team, that goal in your defense, and you're kind of the key to that defense. Do you, how do you not feel pressure, or is it something you don't even think about? You just enjoy playing. I mean, how do you what what how do you you know balance that pressure with just playing your game? Um, well, I, I don't really think about it. I think um, before each game, I go over like my defensive responsibilities and make sure that um, I'm aware of those. But I go out and just have fun to let everyone see how much I love the game and the passion I have for it. And as long as I work hard and you know um, stay positive and work my hardest so that you know my teammates can. That's all I, I can really do. What's the attitude been like in, in practice this week so far? It's been intense. Um, we're all really excited, though. It's been very fun. Um, it's an exciting time because we have gotten this far. And to think that there's only eight teams practicing right now and we're one of them is an honor. So, I mean, we take every um, practice seriously, but still have fun. How do you, how do you put the, the emotions of the, of the Marquette game kind of behind you and focus on, on North Carolina? You just take one game at a time. I mean, that was a great win for us. Um, definitely a lot of emotions going through that game. But now we bounce back and see what an excitement it is to have North Carolina here on our on our game field. You guys have a stellar senior class. Can you talk about some of your senior teammates and what they've meant to this team? Um, I can, I mean, I've loved playing with each and every one of them um, from freshman year to now. They're all amazing people as well as uh, uh, players and they all contribute something different. Um, I've loved playing in the back with Cammie and, and Ashley and Dana and and, that, and Erica, um, she came in with our class. But you know, I love how hard Jess and Carly work up top. They do a ton for our team. Um, all of them are just great players, and I appreciate and admire all of them. How fun is it to have play players come in like Michelle Murphy, players like that that really helped you guys? Is it fun to see most guys practice for the first time? Like, yeah, they can really help. It us. is. Yeah, it's awesome. Uh, Murphy and Paige, I mean, have been two huge freshmen that came in and done so well for us, and they amaze me every game. That you know they. They rise to the occasion, and they've got great talent, and they contribute a lot to our offense as well as defense. Do you remember when you were in that same spot? Yeah. <laughs> Can yeah. You put themselves back and kind of looking around as a wide eyed freshman. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I guess I get a little embarrassed talking about that. But, I mean, it's, you know, as long as they know that we all have confidence in them, I think that helps us going. I mean, for me, I had um, Andrea Willis help me back there. Um, she was the center back at the time and really – um, instilled confidence in me, and that's always nice to have from an upperclassman, knowing that you know these up, upperclassmen you know, have confidence and belief in your abilities to perform. Mm -hmm.